Hey YouTube, Jay Six Honeybees here. We're going to check on the uh, Fun Farm hive that we uh, have done the cutout on the, the speaker uh, about two months ago, maybe a month. I don't know how long exactly. Um, if uh, if they're doing good, I'll probably move them tonight to the uh, bee yard for them to sit for the winter. Uh, it's about 55 degrees here today and uh, windy. I'm not sure that the, these bees are going to like this very much, but. You know, you got to do it when you have time to do it. So uh, I'm going to uh, I'm going to go in there today and see how they're going to act for me. I may get uh, get stung pretty good. Who knows? But uh, you guys have probably noticed this uh, pink veil that I'm wearing today. I I wanted to show some support for uh, breast cancer awareness. I've been trying to get this done for a while now, but uh, this is the first opportunity that I've had to do it. Um, Shout out to uh, Sarah at work for bringing me the veil and, and daring me to do it. I think it's a good idea. I wanted to show support for uh, a good friend of mine and a brother that uh, his wife's in, at war right now with cancer. And, and uh, this is my, uh, my little show of uh, support for them. And uh, I'm, I've got your back. And let's see what we can do with this hive. So like I said, it's pretty cool today. It's in the mid 50s the sun is out but the wind's blowing i don't want to be in here very long i don't want to disturb them too much but i do want to see how they're doing so figure i'd take you guys along and see how they're they're doing since we've done our cutout they're clustered up but guys i'm afraid to say that i'm not sure they're going to make it through winter This is a pretty small hive to be trying to take through winter. They don't have very many stores. This may not make it. So I don't know that I'll put a lot of work into holding on to them this year. Ouch. I just got my first thing, so they're not they're not happy with uh, me being in here, so I'm gonna close them up. I wouldn't blame them. If it was cold out, somebody opened your door and left it open. I knew it was a risk when I done that cutout, uh, but it, it needed to be done for them, and I wanted to make an attempt to save them. Um, I'll take and put some dry sugar in that hive and uh, see if uh, I can keep them along through the winter. But the chances are of them making it is pretty slim at this point. Um, they have hardly any stores at all. Um, I'm going to feed as long as it's not freezing. I'll put some uh, sugar water to them now. Uh, as soon as it starts freezing out, I won't feed them any sugar water anymore. Um, and uh, because that, that has a tendency to uh, lead to uh, moisture in the hive because they're trying to dry it out and they keep bringing in more moisture and it, it's a losing battle but I think it is a losing battle at this point anyways I doubt I moved this hive um, just because it, it if I put it in my yard now they're just gonna get robbed out anything they do have they, my bees are gonna take them so um, I'll just leave it right here and then uh, feed it and feed it and feed it and see if we can build it up enough to make it through winter but the chances of it making are pretty slim hey Thanks for watching. I uh, appreciate your support and breast cancer awareness. Um, last month was a good month. It was uh, it was Halloween yesterday, and everybody loves boo bees. Um, and uh, get it, boo.
bees. And uh, we need to support these, uh, these folks that are going through this hard time right now, especially uh, my corporal. Um, I got your back, we got your back, uh, and uh, we're all praying for you. We're all rooting for you. Hang in there.